What's going on? It's a shot today, and we'll be doing a new weapon review. This weapon is the Tiny Instrument of Death. It is power level 43, and it's statistics right here on screen. Damage 807.4, headshot damage 807.43, critical hit chance 22.5, critical hit 50%, fire rate 3, magazine size 8, range 256, durability 359.8 out of 375. Reload time 2.4, ammo cost 8, and impact uh, 1,375, I believe. This weapon is a heat-seeking missile, basically. If you get it in the general area of the zombies, it will go straight down, as you can see here. I'll shoot it at them, but it'll go straight down. Uh, I'm going to give you an example with the farther zombie. You shoot it at them, it'll go down, or it'll heat-seek onto them. This weapon is very powerful and really fun to use, but it does use up a lot of ammo for how good it is. It takes eight per shot, which means you're going to need at least 900 if you want to get 100 shots off and stuff like that. Um, that's a prime example of the seeking. It'll drop sometimes or it'll lock onto an enemy. You have to shoot it, shoot it in the vicinity of an enemy. But other than that, this weapon does not have much, much, much other stuff to it. But if you're trying to do some splash damage to a horde of zombies, this is definitely your weapon. As you see, it just absolutely slays zombies. Yeah, these zombies are level five but it doesn't matter really much to their level as much as the performance you're seeing from the weapon and how it does and what it does to crowds. If you guys do want to see more weapon reviews, go ahead and wait, 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 I saw something. You can control it. Oh my God. Guys, this is actually remote control. The instrument of death is remote control. Wherever I aim, it'll go. Wow, I, I'm wrong. So uh, it's actually remote controlled. You can shoot this anywhere you want. So let's say theoretically I want to shoot it in the air, I can make it go left, right, or I can make it go straight down. Right there. But it will explode after, it does have durability time in the air. But other than that guys, if you guys keep it on the enemies, you can actually trace them as tier. So this weapon is actually heat, not heat seeking, but actually guided by you. So this is basically a guided missile in Fortnite Battle Royale brought into life and uh, save the world. Other than that, I don't have much to say about this weapon other than it's actually fucking awesome. But if you guys did enjoy, drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And if you guys want me to make more reviews on weapons and stuff like that, drop a like. And yeah, I'll see you.